What's going on everybody? Welcome back to G-Miles World. So EA Sports did this and gamers are furious. The Madden 23 Ultimate Team community is outraged. We've been going over this for a very, very long time. And again, it's not affecting me since my most recent update, but it's affecting a lot of you guys. Many of you guys are at Mutt Level Zero. Um, your dailies are not tracking. And now there has been a new wave of more account bans for completing uh, the John Elway set. I am completely disgusted. I just want you guys to know that. Um, I, I didn't have any intention of completing the set uh, personally because I didn't really feel that a quarterback would be that much of, you know, of an importance for me because I saw the season two that we would eventually get Josh Allen. So I wasn't overly impressed with all of this, but a lot of you guys that have been completing the sets, you've been reporting to me over the last couple of weeks that you've been getting banned. Now there's a new wave of bans and people are getting banned um, pretty much for coin distribution as if they were buying coins. And some of you guys don't even understand what that means. So pretty much it's against the EA terms of service to buy coins from third party uh, sites and stuff like that. If you do it, you take a risk, all that good stuff. You can check out their, um, their terms of agreement on their website uh, at ea.com and just go to the Madden and they'll tell you like the frequently asked questions and all that stuff. If you're having trouble finding out what it is or uh, you, you can't find the verbiage, I will definitely tweet it out. But there's certain things that get you banned um, from playing Madden Ultimate Team. A lot of you guys don't, you, you, you don't even know how to do that stuff and you've been getting banned. So a lot of you guys are very, very furious and outraged. I'm here to tell you, right, that the more that you guys put this out, I need you guys to tweet and tag them at Madden NFL Direct. I want pictures of the actual, um, the screen that's showing that you're banned. I want to know if you've been coin wiped. I want you to tag at Madden NFL Direct and also tag me because I want to see it. Because I want to put together a video of just their regular users, the regular gamers that play their game that are getting wrongfully banned and nobody is talking about it. And I don't really understand. And when I say nobody, I'm talking about the EA staff. Obviously other content creators uh, have spoken about it. I'm not taking anything away from any of them. I'm just saying that enough isn't being done about it for them to immediately fix it. Like most of my viewers went a whole weekend, they got banned on a Friday and then they're still banned now. It's Halloween weekend. It's like you get booked on a Friday, you go to jail, you can't see the judge till Monday. Like it's weird. Why are they doing all of this and it's like automated. These are all automated wrongful bans. So if you're one of those people that were, you know, buying a kicker or buying a card that went into the set that was overpriced and you've been banned uh, for doing the set or for any other reason that's been going on uh, in regards to the John Elway set, I need pictures of it, bro. I need you to tell me here in the video comments and then I need pictures of it because what we're going to do is we got to put together a formulation of all of you. Spread the word, everybody. Let's start putting the visual because we can talk all we want. But you know what it is? You know like that saying, a picture's worth a thousand words? Let's start seeing it. Now look, for those of you guys that are gonna try to sneak in getting unbanned when you actually bought coins or violated the EA terms of agreements, like you were probably freeze glitching and doing weird stuff, EA is going to review all of the accounts, all right? If you're one of those people that did it, you're probably not gonna get unbanned because you shouldn't, you know what I'm saying? But if you're wrongfully banned, I, I, look, like I said, you guys should be furious. I, I saw a lot of angry comments. Uh, I saw a lot of mutt levels at zero. Um, well, not mutt levels, but the um, the field pass at zero. Correction from earlier in the video. Uh, the the, the uh, actual field pass has been zero in addition to now people are getting wrongfully banned for completing the John Elway set. Also, they have a thing where they're checking to see if you're a bot while you're buying the cards. And even when you go into the set to actually do them, like when you go to actually look to put a card in, right? Like say you go to search, when you back out of doing that, they actually, like it's broken. Look look at that. They, they, they delayed it to say they were gonna fix it and it's still broken. And they have the nerve to be banning all of these users. So I understand you guys being furious, but we have to do something about it. And the way to do something about it is to get a culmination of all the pictures and start tweeting them, hashtagging it Madden23, because either they have to get rid of this field pass or they have to do something else. Like I said, they, they are looking into make rights and I'm very happy about that, that they've stepped up and, it, and you know they've acknowledged the fact that the field pass is not working for a lot of individuals, okay? Now, like I said, I don't know if my PlayStation 5 is different from your PlayStation 5 or your Xbox, but once I got the update, this update right here, I'm gonna show you guys again. When they released this update 1.006, mine was fixed, okay? I have zero, like bro, all of my stuff has been tracking properly. 
but I will not stand by while yours are not tracking properly. Okay, so I'm taking away from other content to get you guys involved and, you know, want you guys to get your stuff up and running. Now, look, they did promise, well, I don't want to say promise, but the developers did say that once they investigate it and they find out exactly what was going on, that everyone that was affected will be compensated for it. What I'm assuming is that if you've been doing your dailies, right, and your daily tracker hasn't been tracking, or whatever the reasoning behind what's going on with your particular instance is not processing, they are going to grant you that XP. That is the only way they can fix it, or they would have to give you the players, whether it's the competitive pass. Also, guys, let me know if your solo battles went down as well. That's another thing. I had a couple uh, no money spent players that are offline players because they want their sanity. Their solo battles just disappeared. Like, what is wrong with this company? Okay, so we got to talk about the competitive pass in a second, but this would be the best make right. Give the players that were not able to advance and get their XP the free players. Don't worry about the packs because they're not going to give you everything unless they are really generous and they're like, you know what? Let's give them everything uh, through the line. I would just say grant everyone that was affected a Josh Allen. Let me know if you agree with that because I'll push that if that's something that you were looking to do. I wouldn't go Dion because Dion hasn't, we're not close enough to get to Dion yet. So Dion is a little bit further away, even though I've seen some people that glitched the game that has him already. So I don't want to say Dion, but I do believe that most of us will be getting Josh Allen if our uh, field pass were tracking correctly. So I would say grant everyone that's been affected by this XP uh, situation a free Josh Allen. Let me know what you think about that because I will definitely, you know, tweet that out uh, in support of you guys. Also, my competitive pass since the patch has been working correctly. I've seen footage. I've seen pictures. I know yours is not working correctly. What really bothers me, though, is the fact that the solo battles make it so difficult to get these players. And EA Sports developers have the nerve to have the... Bro, they just disappear. You know what I'm saying, bro? Houdini style. Dude. This is not okay, all right? It's not okay. So again, I understand you guys are being furious. I wanna see, you know, when, when, when your solo battles are down, tweet me a picture of it at G Myers World and tag at Madden NFL Direct, all right? Because this is what we need to address. As far as what the actual gameplay is happening, I got videos coming for you guys. A lot of you guys were asking about uh, specific things with the abilities. Also, all of my members uh, that have been joining had some questions about certain abilities, what works, what doesn't. I got a video dropping for you guys very soon, but I believe that this is very important because you guys deserve to get mossed the same way I've been getting mossed. You deserve that to happen to you. Why is it only me? You think I'm doing this because I really just want everybody to have fun? I want you to go into this gameplay head-to-head, -head, dude, and have a guy with no brains just moss you uncontrollably. And what's happening is a lot of you guys are taking a step back from the game because you're frustrated. And I want to bring back that joy of watching you rage, whether you stream, however you do it. I just want to watch other people go through my pain when I watch Harold Carmichael just jump over my player alt with no abilities and moss me into another galaxy. Please let me know if yours is not tracking correctly. I will tell you this. I did tweet out recently that I was able to get uh, the new Palomalu card. So mine has been tracking correctly. It's not about me. Okay. It's about you guys. We got to work together to get this done. And I think together we can reach EA Sports and have everyone get their competitives, get their regular season XP and be right back on the horse. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. You have an unbelievable day. Until next time. One love, y'all.